This is a really quick fix for those who are trying to get their Guitar Hero controller to work on the PC because uh, obviously Clone Hero is out, people want to be playing it so they're going out and buying guitars and the most common ones are the wireless ones and they go out online and they purchase one of these things here. So that, what you're looking at there is a generic uh, wireless USB receiver. Now these things intermittently work and sometimes they don't so I'm just going to show you a really quick way to fix it. The main problem is actually because of the heat sink that's down the bottom. So I'm going to show you how, how to actually remove it. So just giving you guys a heads up, I've already disassembled this because I'm holding the camera with my right hand so I can't actually do it. But basically you need to get a sharp object and then start chipping away here. There's a little groove over here. So you just want to get under that with a knife or a screwdriver or something like that and then flip it up. Same thing down here as well. And then it should be very straightforward and then you lift it up like this. Now, there are two screws over here and here, which I've subsequently already removed. These ones. And then very gently, let's see if I can grab this with my one hand, very gently you pull this out like this, okay? So you put that to one side, you don't, you don't touch it. But this thing here, this thing is the problem maker. So that's normally stuck on with glue, you just simply take it out with a knife or something like that and then you put everything back in together and that should basically resolve all the issues. Alright guys, back on the computer, once you've plugged in your now adjusted device, go to device manager and then look for the item that says unknown device. Right click it, go to update driver, browse my computer for, uh, for driver software, go to let me pick scroll all the way down here to Xbox 360 peripherals, double click that. Now you get given two options here. I want you guys to go for the 2.1, the 2009 version, okay? Press next, press yes, and that should resolve your problems. All right, so we're currently running this on the Gibson Le Paul, the most common wireless guitar uh, for Clone Hero. Let's give this one a go and see whether or not this has fixed all of our problems. Pretty good so far. Alright, so there you go guys, give it a go, it's a really easy fix. All you gotta do is just be patient, take your time to peel everything out, and then it's all fine and dandy. Just leave the comments uh, below and let me know how you went. All the best.